Time now for At the Market from Neiman's Family Market in St. Clair. At the Market is brought to you by CTV Community TV of Marine City in St. Clair. Fifth Third Bank, the Curious Bank. St. John's River District Hospital. And the Coast Guard Cutter Bramble, where tours are now available. Now let's join our host for this week's At the Market. Hello and welcome to another episode of At the Market. I'm Kristen Bain and we're here at Neiman's Market in beautiful St. Clair. I'm the owner of the Schoolhouse Grill on Harsons Island and today I'll be joined with Justin Fett who cooks with me at the Schoolhouse Grill. We're going to be cooking up a nice dish from our menu for you. You can even do this at home. We'll also be um, joined today by Therese Hawkins from St. Clair Recreation Department and Kathy Pizzo, the store director and manager here at Neiman's Market, to talk about Safety Town. We'll be right back after this. Challenge the clock. Challenge trends. Go. Challenge gravity. <laughs> Challenge expectations. Challenge world records. Challenge the culture and the future. Challenge banking. We challenge ourselves to be curious about ideas that make banking better. We're Fifth Third Bank, the Curious Bank. At St. John Providence, we believe it's important to have things you can depend on, like knowing you and your family have access to high quality care whenever you need it. That's why our nearly 1,000 primary care doctors offer same day appointments and why so many of them are available nights and weekends, which means that no matter where you are in Southeast Michigan, you're never far from care that focuses on the entire person, body, mind, and spirit. St. John Providence, believe in better. Hi, and welcome back to At The Market. Again, I'm Kristen Bain, and I'm joined by Justin Fett Hello. from Schoolhouse Grill. And today we're gonna cook up for you a chow fun. This is a menu item at the restaurant that's very popular. And it's got a, a Korean background, um, but I grew up in Hawaii and this is something I grew up eating. So I brought it to the restaurant, brought it to the menu, and it's been really popular ever since. So we started with what, a little sesame oil yep, in the pan? a little sesame oil, just getting it heated up. So walk us through this. Okay, we're gonna add a little sesame oil, uh, some chopped garlic. Okay. Make sure your pan is uh, nice and warm so you hear that sizzle when you put the garlic in. We're going to add some uh, ground sausage. We do our, our um, sausages house ground. You can use any sausage you want, your favorite ground sausage that you get at your local market, like Neiman's. We already brown this, but you'll brown this in the pan and get it nice and seared so there's a nice uh, color to it, right? Yes, yes. So go ahead and off. Then we're going to add a little bit of soy sauce. Soy sauce, very salty, so you want to start light. You can always add more. Then we will add uh, some of our cabbage. A shredded cabbage. You can already smell the garlic and the sausage cooking. We should gather a crowd here at Neiman's Market pretty yes. soon with the yeah. bit smell of, of garlic. We'll do it every time. So fresh carrot. This is a very colorful dish, and what's nice about it is it doesn't take long at all. You can do this ho at home in a flash. It's easy. It's um, relatively very inexpensive to make, so um, makes for a great dish. You can feed a lot of people with it. We're just going to let this cook down a little bit. Saute it up. While this is cooking, um, it's a great opportunity for us to let you know what's going on at the Schoolhouse Grill this summer. So starting this year, we're doing a Saturday night concert series. Yeah. Um, every Saturday night a different band at the restaurant that leads up to our uh, Roots Music Festival which is August 20th this year. So lots of live music on a Saturday night, barbecue, um, patio bar open and we'll be having a great time. We got five acres behind the school so it's a big open yard and you can come and sit and watch live music on a Saturday night, have some good food and hang out with us. We're all uh, ready for it. Yeah, definitely. Yes. It's been a long winter. Yes. <laughs> We need so, some excitement. Yeah, we need some more excitement in our life. So come and see us. So we're um, sauteing this down. To this, we'll add a little bit of color with some red cabbage. Um, and this is a dish you can play with too. You know, you can add whatever vegetables you want. 
You could add broccoli to this dish. We've cooked it with shrimp instead of sausage, scallops instead of sausage. Yes. So there's all kinds of things you can do with this, but it makes for a great stir fry. So into this, a little bit of oyster sauce. Oyster sauce you can pick up at your local market um, or a Korean market if you uh, have a favorite that you shop. This all gets combined together. And then to this, some fresh chopped uh, green onion. You don't mind if I? No, I don't mind. Throw it in there. Thank you. Some cracked pepper. We've got some fresh cracked pepper, a must. Everybody can start smelling this cooking. And then what we're using is uh, lo mein noodles. Um, however, you can use uh, fettuccine noodles. We've used uh, fettuccine in the past. You can use rice noodles. You can use a gluten-free noodle with this. So really, the choice is yours. If you would prefer rice, you could do that as well. So let's Thank you. put that in there. Get that stirred right down to the heat. And then to this, once we get our noodles in here and incorporated with all of the ingredients, we can then add a little more soy sauce, a little more oyster sauce until all of the noodles are coated and um, it cooks together. You want to let this saute for probably about, what did you say, a good five minutes at, at least. least right. And get all your um, ingredients incorporated and all your flavors incorporated. So once again, um, we're going to plate this up and uh, show you what this looks like. Stir that up real good, add a little a more, more oyster in there. Yeah. We'll get this plated up for you and show you how this looks. Again, um, Saturday nights at Schoolhouse Grill. Also this year, we're introducing a volleyball league and a uh, cornhole or a bag toss league, whatever you like to call it, but that'll be a lot of fun. Those will be on Thursday nights. So you can come and uh, check us out on Thursday nights for our league. Uh, you can visit our uh, website, harsonsislandschoolhousegrill.com for more information on that. We are also updating our website, so stay tuned for that. You can also get information on Facebook. And um, call the restaurant if you have questions about any of our leagues. All right. We have great specials. Thank you very much, Paul. Every uh, night of the week that we are open, our summer hours will start after Memorial Day. Uh, we will be closed on Mondays. We'll be open Tuesday through Sunday. Um, we have Mother's Day coming up, so we'll be open for Mother's Day from 9 till 2 p.m. with a select menu, a beautiful brunch menu. So you can come bring mom. Again, Schoolhouse Grill is a beautiful spot on the island. It makes for a nice day trip, so come out and bring your mom and treat her to a nice uh, brunch and hang out on our uh, property and enjoy the view. Hopefully it's sunny out that day. Too. I hope so too, because we could use some of that. Yes. Although it's getting pretty nice out right now, yes. finally. So let's plate this up so they can see how beautiful it looks. Okay. We can always put it back in there, cook it up a little more if we want to for service. We'll go right in that. Awesome. You want all of it? Yeah, well, right. keep going, keep going. Get some of that sausage on top. That's cool. And then we always top it with a little more cabbage for crunch, a little more scallion, and a little more carrot for color. And there we go. And that's Schoolhouse Grill Chow Fun. You should come and check this out. It's a great little dish, and people really enjoy it. I think you'd like it, too. Uh, we'll be back with uh, Therese Hawkins from St. Clair Recreation Department to talk to you about Safety Town. We'll be back in a minute. Thanks. Sometimes asking for help is the hardest thing you can do, but it is the most important step toward recovery. St. Clair County Community Mental Health provides publicly funded mental health services for adults and children with mental illnesses, developmental disabilities, substance use disorders, or serious emotional disturbances. Call the access line toll free at 888-225-4447. 24 hours a day, seven days a week. St. Clair County Community Mental Health, promoting opportunities for discovery and recovery. The retired United States Coast Guard Cutter Bramble is now open for tours seven days a week. Docked at the Port Huron Seaway Terminal Bean Dock, the U.S. Coast Guard Bramble has tours daily from 10 a.m. till 4 p.m. General admission gives you basic access to the ship, $8 for adults, 
$6 for seniors and under 18. The Commandant's Gold Pass gives you a historical, full access guided tour. $12 for adults, $10 for seniors and under 18. Don't miss the Bramble's special Memorial Day Remembrance coming up the end of May. Come tour the White Portuguese as seen in the Batman vs. Superman Down of Justice movie, Delivering the Kryptonite. Hello and welcome back to At The Market. Again, I'm Kristen Bain and I'm joined with Therese Hawkins from St. Clair County Recreational Department. Or City Rec, yes. Okay, and <laughs> Kathy Pizzo, who's the store director and manager here at Neiman's Market. And we are talking about... Safety tell me. Town Day. Safety Town Day. <laughs> okay, well give me some information on Safety okay. Town. It's an annual event. We okay. have it right here in the Neiman's Family Market parking lot. Perfect and we bring in all kinds of safety um, agencies. We have police, fire, EMS, um, we have a school bus. Okay. The post office is here. So the fire trucks pull in, yes. school buses yes. pull in, and the kids get a chance to explore and check things out? Yep, there's a lot of information for parents and kids on how to have a safe summer. Okay. Uh, actually, all, all year round safety. Okay, so and tell us when this takes place. It's on Saturday, May 14th from 10 a.m. until 12.30. Okay, so perfect. So we just pack everything in and this in a is short amount of time. A free event for everybody to it's join in? It's a free in. event and we have, um, one of our sponsors is McLaren Hospital. Okay. And this year they're going to have helmets available for the kids for $5. They'll get a helmet, a bicycle helmet. Okay. And they'll make sure that it's properly fitted for the child. So that's something new. We try to do something new every year sure. um, for the program. And then Neiman's. They have some things they help us. They give us bottled water. We're hoping for a nice day. Okay. Excellent. And um, they also give out some um, first aid supplies okay. for the families. Very good. And So I lots of information for yes. families to draw on about safety. And, um, and it's fun to, yeah. So tell us a little right. bit about the, your um, the part rest in of all the of story? this. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, we partner with that. It's a great event. And then uh, we have a Bark for Life event for the... Relay for Life, and they'll okay. be doing a hot dog cookout. Okay, that was so, my next question. Can yes, they eat? Food. Get something to eat here? That's right. Something? Okay, great, great. And, and then they could come in after and do some shopping they if they could, needed and to. Then okay. It's also our uh, graduation celebration, and our graduation celebration is a showcase of what you can get here at Neiman's for your big parties. Excellent. So that's Excellent. from eleven to four. Wow. So there's a lot going on. Lots, lots going on, to lots a wonderful to day. Uh, absorb and great information. What is going to happen here in the bagel shop? <laughs> we are going to be uh, having a little renovation going on. So oh, as soon okay. as I get more details with that, I will I so will be on again. A little fa a little facelift at Neiman's yes, Market. A lot of facelift. So okay. stuff to look forward to. Is that going to be not done by this May 14th? But no. that'll be when will that start taking well, place? Well, we're hoping it will start soon. Okay, good. And. Uh, as we get dates, we will pass those on, but there will be some renovation, and we're going to make sure it doesn't affect the customer, but it okay. will be fun. Okay, well, excellent. That sounds good. It looks like there's a lot to look forward to. Come down to Neiman's Market on May 14th from 1030 till 10 to 1230. 10 to 1230. Uh, visit Safety Town. Let the kids explore. Get some really good and useful information for yourselves. Um, anything else you want to talk about or tell I'll, them? I'll do one more plug because it's a community event. Yes. Um, that's the same day that the post office is doing their food drive. Awesome. And you can leave your cans on the porch, your wow. porch, while okay. The, okay. they deliver the mail and pick that up. But they're also going to be here on site. So if oh, anybody awesome. wants to drop off cans Perfect. after shopping at Neiman's, <laughs> right? Yes. Perfect. Um, they'll take them Sounds great. Sounds like a great site. day to come down and um, take advantage of all that's going on here on May 14th from 10 till 1230 again at Neiman's Market right out here in the parking lot. Please join us again next week at, at the market when we join Catch 22 from my neck of the woods, Elginac. We'll see you next week. Thank you very much. Great job. Very right. nice. You've been watching At the Market from Neiman's Family Market in St. Clair. At the Market is brought to you by CTV Community TV of Marine City and St. Clair. Fifth Third Bank, The Curious Bank, St. John's River District Hospital, and the Coast Guard Cutter Bramble where tours are now available. Join us again soon for another At the Market.